This card is for Warata Blossom 156, which is a great chapter in the book Flies. Um, Eight of Swords. Swords are air, mind, ways of thinking. Uh, this has to do with using what you can see is the two cards in the foreground, the two swords in the foreground, which are identical, which are sort of the boundary. Now the cards that are the cards that are underneath, they have the possibility. They have they are just ideas coming up, there are thoughts, there are ways of thinking that are coming up. And now if you use the balanced dual sides of the brain, the thinking and doing and the feeling and being, this is observing things like you would do in meditation. Um, you know, you, you can't, suppressing things is a terrible fucking idea. We have about 2,000 years of evidence to prove that. Um, so this is the idea of in your mind when things rise up, like recognizing them, stopping them where they are, but recognizing what they are, giving yourself the time to observe what they are and what that means and where that puts you. Now if these swords, if these ideas are mathematically negative, and they're just taking away, they're not adding to anything, or they're not taking away something that's useful, you see them as they are. Um, this is, I would say, a boundary card, a mental boundary card, where you have the ability now, with your strong dualistic mind, to stop things and to observe them, again, like you would do in meditation, so you can see things as they are, and if they're useful, let them be, if they're not, well, let them go. Um, astrologically, Jupiter and Gemini, Jupiter is expansion and influence, and Gemini is duality, it's the, it's the two things that, that you go between, and this is expanding in an even way. Um, so if you wanted to do that, then you have to acknowledge the things that are arising in your mind, and those things that arise in your mind you should be able to observe. It's part of will is to be able to stop things and call them as they are. Um, and this is a big process of like what needs to be done right now is observing like the thoughts and the thinking and the intellect, the ruach like behind what it is that you're going for. Um, and if you intend to like, you know, carry on with what you're doing, you have to observe your own thoughts, the little things that come up and sort of, you know, make things more complicated. So it's just to say, there are, there are a lot of ideas, there are a lot of inspiration and new things that come up, but you have to be able to recognize them as such for yourself. Uh,